Hey guys, this is Ellie with your week of 29th of January 2018. So this week you are having a um, equal and balanced uh, righting of wrongs at your place of work, your um, study or your investments. So you could find in your investments that if anything had been um, uh, going up or going down or um, if there's been numbers that were skewed, you'll find that that will relax this week and you'll be finding uh, that you'll uh, get those dividends. For those of you in study, this is about finding that mentor, finding someone who you can work with in a collaborating way. Uh, it is a yes as well. This is a yes, um, the Six of Pentacles. Uh, and this is saying that you will um, be on an equal basis, but especially in study, you will be able to find someone who is a mentor, someone that you can work well with, uh, that will be able to uh, help you uh, this year. Those of you at work, uh, this is about having balance at work. This is about... Um, some of you might be working in charity this year or uh, giving your time or as a group at work uh, doing a run or collecting money for some sort of charity. But this is about uh, giving back what you've um, had or someone doing that for you. This is also, um, again, saying that your work, you're going to find balance if there's been you know, more resources given to another department or another person or more favoritism, that this week you're going to find that there is more of an equal balance. Uh, as well as uh, to do with leaders this week, if your employer or um, a leader um, will be handing down justice and it will be a yes. At home we do have the nine of swords. So this is um, a air sign, Gemini, Libra or Aquarius, who is feeling um, insomniac, is uh, got a lot on their mind, a lot of stressing. Uh, this is also saying that there's someone in the family could be awake at night through uh, pain or seizures or uh, even depression this week. Uh, there's a lot going on in this house about um, having to take on extra resp responsibility, um, you know, too much on your mind, too much physical exertion, which comes out in a physical uh, sense uh, this week. Uh, also, um, the next card is your health, which specifically is about sciatic nerve um, and hips. Um, so you could find that this is what is uh, ailing you. So with your uh, health, you do have the Nine of Cups, which is the wish card, which means, you know, getting that emotional wish, that emotional um, yes that you need to do with your health, specifically sciatic nerve, hips and hips and thighs, sciatic nerve and liver. So that's good results for those areas, uh, a wish card. And this is emotional fulfillment and contentment. So you're happy with those results. In your love, you do have the devil card. Uh, this is a major arcana card in regards to uh, the cycles that you're in. So for singles, this could be a really uh, great hookup. Uh, you know, it's drug, sex and rock and roll. Uh, for those of you that have been dating on and off, this week you're going to feel like um, there's manipulation, narcissism or a continued uh, abusive relationship going on um, this week. Those of you that are couples, uh, you might find um, that you feel chained or stuck or feeling uh, depressed about your relationship or feeling the strain of your relationship is a better term um, this week in regards to, you know, perhaps uh, someone's overspending, perhaps someone's you know, overindulging. This is the addiction card. So, you know, um, drug, sex, rock and roll, um, addictions, uh, narcissism, those kinds of things. So an imbalance there. And this is a major arcana card. So this could be a major moment. Now, uh, don't forget on the 31st of January, there is a, um, an eclipse um, on the 31st so this could be energy leading up to that uh, this could be the start of you know difficult times for some couples but others this is about um there's a capricorn around this this is about um to move forward in a relationship is best through uh, open communication perhaps even uh, getting therapy involved so your drawing virtue messages from the angels is Astara says you deserve the best. Reach for the stars uh, with your dreams and desires and don't compromise. So, you know, you do have the yes at work, study or school. Uh, and you also have wish fulfillment to do with your health uh, this um, week as well. 
so stay positive uh, if there is some rumblings going on especially if this is you this person who is sleepless worrying about you know too much thoughts too much you know thinking over overthinking over anxiety those kinds of things as well and then you have uh, area which is about you know your intuition psychic experiences uh, dreams aha moments that may occur this week um, to show some enlightenment and guidance about what's coming up next so be kind to you and those you love and I shall see you next week.